All right, so after you review Goofus and Gallant, if you haven't reviewed the rules, please go back and review them just to make sure we're all on the same page because um, we have some new people coming into the school too. Happy New Year to everyone and hope that you had a good break. Uh, know that I did. So if my camera is going to, all right, I don't know how to throw it out in the street. Good. All right, so uh, we're going to hold off still on the Million Dollar Tree House project. Um, I'm not sure when we're going to get back to that because everything's still kind of up in the air uh, with this pandemic. So we're just going to hold off on that um, indefinitely until we are sure we can actually do the project together. All right. Um, for this, instead, we are going to doodle the Google. We're just going to start out with an easy project um, for us to do. If you've ever gone to the Google home page, to the search bar, you'll notice that every day the Google logo changes. I've included a um, Google montage that, yeah, it's a little long, but it's good. It gives you a lot of inspiration. I want you to doodle the Google with something that is important to you or something that you want to do in the new year. So let's go ahead and start out by writing out, and they have the old school G. Start out by writing out Google. All right, and I better do this in something darker so y'all can actually see. I'll probably go ahead and do a different version of this just so I don't have to work with crayon. All right. Once you have that, go ahead, put in the middle, and bubble letter this. You'll be working with pencil, so it'll be a little easier for you. So, So I got the word Google. It's a little wonky. Give me a break, it's my first day back. All right, it's a little wonky, but now I'm gonna think about things that I want to do in 2021. It is a new year, not quite a new you, and yes, we're still in the middle of this, but we're quickly, quickly, quickly coming to the end of it with the vaccines coming out. I want you to think of something that you want to do or something that you like to do that you will do in 2021, and for me, that's going to be gardening. So you can do a thinking list. So I think of gardening my trowel, seeds, uh, plants, of course, flowers. All right, so I got a little thinking list going. I got my Google listed out. So now I can think about what I want on this. I think this would look much better as a tree instead. All right, and I definitely, you know what? I'm gonna turn one of these into a melon. On a vine. All right, a melon on a vine and it comes around the other circle and it's literally just you kind of thinking as you draw. You can make as many changes to it as you want. You can revise it as much as you want. You could scrap it and start all over if you want. But you gotta turn it in something. Okay, that does not give you an excuse to not turn it in anything. I'm gonna have some spire flowers here. So I actually have a garden happening. And yeah, it's in crayon and yeah, it's messy. I'm gonna go back and definitely redo this. Cause I, I'm only working with crayon so y'all can see it easily. All right, uh, let's see, how about some moss on things? Okay, some moss on top of my normal, normal 
letters. Maybe a lattice behind this. All right, so my focus is gardening for my doodle, the Google. So go ahead, put your thinking caps on, make a thinking list if you need, and doodle your Google. And don't forget to watch the video, it's actually quite nice on um, different themes that Google has had over the years. We had the Olympics coming up this year. We have a vaccine that's rolling out. Um, we have things that people have been doing all together, like staying at home, quarantining. Um, excited to see family from a distance. Uh, excited to see your friends from a distance. Maybe you do a uh, logo where it's all masks. Who knows? but I want you to doodle your Google. I can't wait to see what y'all come up with. I'll have my other finished example, because I'm not using this, waiting for you in, um, in uh, the Google Classroom. All right, can't wait to see what y'all do. Bye.